you. Magandang hapon, Pilipinas at buong mundo. Naitay kapuso. Pahiram po ng 20 minutes ng inyong hapon. Ako po si Boy and welcome to Fast Talk with Boy Abunda. Umpisahan ho natin ang ating programa with uh, for today's talk. Una, ay marami ang nagtatanong kung permanente na ba o regular na mag-host si Isko Moreno sa Eat Bulaga. Dahil mula pa noong Sabado ay napapanood na ho natin si Isko bilang bahagi ng programa. Meron siyang portion na ang tawag ay... G sa Gedli. Uh, kanina pinag-uusapan namin anong Gedli. Sabi ko, sa waray, dahil waray din itong isko ay gilid, ligid sa, sa gilid, ika nga. And uh, kinausap ng programa si Wawi Rojas, ang manager ni isko, at uh, nagkwento si Wawi na in-offer ng Tape Incorporated si isko para mag-host ng Eat Bulaga. At ito nga ang dahilan kung bakit nakikita natin siya araw-araw. But they haven't signed a contract with tape yet. Dahil nasaan si Isko? Uh, he's testing the waters. Nakikiramdam kung siya ay tatanggapin, kung siya ay uh, uh, yayakapin ika nga ng sambayan ng Pilipino. And uh, he'll take it from there. Kung siya ay mamahalin muli uh, sa television at kung siya ay tatanggapin ng tape, ay he is willing uh, to host Eat Bulaga regularly. I spoke to Isko Moreno just shortly before the show. Nag-usap po kami sa telepono at sinabi ko, kumusta ka? Sabi niya, masayang masaya ako dahil uh, nakakatulong ako sa ating mga kababayan. Second nature sa kanya ang pagtulong. At ang sabi niya ay, uh, this is his way of coming home. Dahil dito po sa GMA 7, nagsimula si Isko Moreno sa That's Entertainment at sa GMA Super Show. So this is his way of, uh, sabi nga niya, uh, wow, nagsisimula muli ako. And he used the word muscle memory. Ganun pala yun, uh, sabi niya, pag nakaharap ka na sa camera, alam mo na ang gagawin mo. So, uh, Isko, welcome. Welcome home. Pangalawa, uh, night tayo kapuso. Noong nakaraang Sabado, Gardo Versosa, our ating kaibigan, was supposed to undergo uh, his second angi- angioplasty. Yeah. Tama, uh, biyernes, I'm sorry. 10 o'clock in the morning Friday, pero madaling araw pa lang ng biyernes ay nanakit ang likod ni Gardo at uh, nahirapan huminga. Reason for his wife, Ivy, to bring him to the hospital. At doon nga, ang findings ay bumaba po ang kanyang hemoglobin at kinailangan salina ng dugo. So, hindi natuloy ang kanyang operasyon. At uh, sa kasalukuyan, siya ay nagpapahinga. He needs to rest. And uh, after two weeks, but he's okay. Gardo is safe. After two weeks, uh, ititest muli siya kung siya ay handa na para sa kanyang pangalawang angioplasty. Ang sa akin lamang ay sa ating mga kababayan, sa ating mga kapuso, ay ipagpatuloy ho natin ang pagdadasal natin para sa ating kaibigang Gardo Versosa. Samantala, naitay kapuso, ang ating bisita ngayong hapon. Uh, is the undeniable star. Please welcome Rita Daniela. Maraming maraming salamat, Rita. Salamat, Rita Boy. Hindi ko akalain na ganyan kakasexy. Wow. Totoo. Salamat. First time. This is the first time I'm uh, doing an interview with Rita. Salamat. Yes, maraming maraming salamat sa yung pagdalaw. Alam niyo po, uh, Naitay Kapuso, ilang beses po na reschedule ang interview <laughs> na ito because she is a hands-on mom. Tama ako? Yes po. So how is that experience? Um, actually, nalulungkot ako na nagpapareschedule ako kasi talagang I'm very, very excited to be here. But also, syempre, I'm a full-time breastfeeding. Syempre kay Uno. So, um, medyo nahihirapan ako sa, sa side na yun, pero masaya actually. I'm, I'm very happy to be Uno's mother. Yeah. Super happy. And it happened today. I mean, the guesting was meant to happen today, kaya mm-hmm. nangyari ngayong araw na ito. Yes. If you were to write a note mm-hmm. to self, a message to yourself, ano yung sasabihin mo ngayon? Whatever it is, you've done a great job. So just keep doing your thing and be great at it. I believe you. <laughs> you are undeniably uh, a star. Oh, Let's do fast you. talk. Yes! Okay. We have two minutes to do this and our time begins now. All out Sundays, all out nanay. All out Sundays. Queendom, queen mom. Queen mom. Singlehood, motherhood. Motherhood. Sinong mas magaling sa nananay? Si Aubrey o ikaw? Ako. <laughs> Tagulan o tagaraw? Tagulan. Dalawang ako o dalawang ikaw? Dalawang ikaw. Namimiss mo kay Ken Chan? 
yung uh, tawa po niya. Kinaiinusan mo kay Ken Chan? Ano, kuripot. <laughs> baby Angelo or baby Uno? Baby Uno. Bilang nanay, ilang oras ang tulog mo? <laughs> Tatlo. <laughs> Best moment as a mom? As a mom, the moment I gave birth to mm. you. Acting or singing? Both, Tita Boy. Your goal as a singer? To write songs not just for myself but for other people also. Your goal as an actress? To be the best actress. Bida or contra bida? Both. Bida showbiz or non-showbiz? Both. <laughs> On screen or behind the scenes? Um, behind the scenes. Itinanggi or itinatanggi? Uh, next question, please. Pinaglihian mo kay Uno? Mga guapo. Gusto mong mamana ni Uno sa'yo? Ah, uh, yung pagiging passionate. Ayaw mong mamana? Impatient. Dasal para kay Uno? Ah, uh, has, maging, magaran siya ng heart for people. Your song for Uno? My song for Uno? Just a title. Wala pang title but it's my composition and I will release it soon. Wow. Song for yourself? For myself. Um... Nakogirap. Next, lights on, lights off. Dim. <laughs> happiness or chocolates? Both. Best time for happiness? Any time. Complete the sentence. My name is Rita and I am. Mom, stop a ball. Oh. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Balikan ko lang yung mga pinaglihian uh, mong mga guapo. Sino sino sila? <laughs> Ay, ang kitang-kita nyo naman, may dimple si Uno eh. Pinaglihian ko kasi si Mabili Gaspi at nagpaalam ako kay Kailin. <laughs> sabi Sinabi, ko, ang sabi mo, Kailin, ay... okay lang ba pagliin ko, paglihian ko si Mavi? Sabi, sabi ko, go lang, go lang. Sige lang. <laughs> ako naman sa so super titig naman ako kay Mavi ngayon nung nag-work ako sa All Out Sundays. Madami. You know what, what's so interesting, Rita, is that I was told na pinagdaanan mo ang tatlong pangalan. Rita Irinian, Rita de Guzman, until narating mo yung Rita Daniela. Yes. What's the story? Si Rita Irinian kasi, um, siya talaga yung uh, uh, kontesera. Kasi hindi, hindi rin po ako pwede magpalit ng pangalan kasi it's a rule. When you're in a competition, kailangan real name. So, Rita Irinian. Okay. That's where I got the title, the Popstar Kid Grand Champion. I was just 11 years old that time. And Rita de Guzman was the actress era. I think that time kasi puro talagang yun yung contribute roles yung ginagawa ko um, hanggang sa I quit because I really felt that parang sa sobrang passionate ko kasi Tito Boy na uuwi ko po yung ginagawa ko sa trabaho so I quit being a contribute kasi feeling ko parang hindi na ako to um, so I had to stop doing it and then Rita Daniela was um, is actually Rita Daniela is uh, she's an actress, a singer, a songwriter, um, and a mom. And the undeniable star. Okay. Na mention mo kanina yung uh, pop star kids. Kasabayan mo dun si Julian San Jose. Yes. You came out the grand champion. Yes, sir. Rita, direct sang tanong. Nakikita mo ngayon si Julian. She's doing concerts. Uh, she has successful teleseries, top rating teleseries, movies. In other words, she's on top of her game. Kasabayan mo. Pag nakikita mo ba si Julian, may konting kurot, may, may konting inggit. Wala po, Tito Boy. Kasi naniniwala po ako na we all have our seasons. At ito ang season ni Julie. At ang season ko ngayon is to be a full-time mom at maging, um, to be the best mom to Uno. And since nanggaling kami sa competition, para understood na yun sa amin na we have this healthy competition because we're both competitive. And I like that about us. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. And I wish you the best. I Thank love that. You. I mean, each one of us has a season. Are you back in the race? Are you back in the game? Yes, I would love to. You would love to? Yes. Okay. Uh, Rita, early on, nung nag-uumpisa, nagsisimula ang Fast Talk with Boya Bunda, naging bisita namin si Ken Chan. Okay. These are questions that I've always wanted to ask. Number one, sabi ni Ken Chan, nagmahalan daw kayo, pero sinaktan ka niya. Mm. So I'd like to know, what is your version of the story? Pangalawa, pinangarap mo raw talaga maging isang ina. Pangatlo, there are speculations na kasalukuyan ang 
ama ng iyong anak na si Uno ay nagkahiwalay na kayo. Speculations. Ano ba ang totoo? Ano ba ang mga kasagutan? Malalaman ho natin sa pagbabalik ng Fast Talk with Boy. Yeah! Boy Abunda, kasama pa rin po natin si Rita Daniela, The Undeniable Star. I love it. I love the title. Okay, sometime February, kung hindi ako nagkakamali, naging bisita namin dito si Ken, uh, Ken Chan. And uh, naikwento nga niya na nagmahalan kayo. And then, sinaktan ka niya. Mm -mm. <laughs> What is your version of the story? Siguro masasabi ko na lang yung nangyari sa amin ni Ken. It's an almost love story. Almost. Almost. Mm -mm. Kasi ang almost, yun yung masakit, di ba? Yun yung, it's like, um, so soon, ay so far, mali ako, sorry, dito. Hindi, okay lang. Uh -oh. Ano ba yun? Uh -oh. Ken na... kasi, charot. <laughs> okay. Yung parang ang so layo na. So close, but yet so far. Ah, okay, so close, yet so far. Yes. Okay, nahulog ka, no? Oo naman. Mm -hmm. Hindi ko po pagkakailayo. Tsaka, wala, ganun talaga eh. Ako rin po actually, hindi ako naniniwala nung yung mga love team. Hindi totoo yan. Kasi work lang yan eh. Sobrang nagulat ako doon sa konsepto na, ay, kasi pag magkasama kayo araw-araw, nade-develop pala talaga. Oo, oh, it's a very intimate business. You spend a lot of time together. Yes, may, may nagsasabi niya eh, in show business, when you do uh, teleseries, mga pelikula, maraming panahon kasi na kayo lang, mm. and then you start to appreciate each other. Opo. Okay, but maganda ba ang paghihiwalay niyo? I mean, did you guys talk about it? Actually, we stopped talking for a long time. Mm. I, had, uh, I had to, you know, give time for myself because... Um, yung nangyari sa amin ni Ken, I j just didn't lose uh, a friend. I lost a best friend and a family in one. Mm. It was, that was very painful for me. But, you know, um, okay naman kami, naging okay kami. Actually, nung nakita kami ulit, nasabi ko sa sarili ko, tsaka sa, yun, from yung kanyang interview dito, bin binisita niya talaga niya kami ni Uno. Tapos sabi ko sa kanya, kaya alam mo, narealize ko sa sarili ko, ikaw talaga pa rin yung best friend ko. Kasi after all, siya pa rin yung talagang kilalang kilala ko, yung tingin lang yung nagkakaintindihan talaga kami. And I think um, okay na kami sa ganun na parang nagkakaintindihan kami na okay na yun. Oh. Kung ano man yun, okay na yun. Ako ang, what I'm hearing is that, kasi hindi mo pinilit eh, uh, you give yourself time. May, may oras para magproseso. ba diba? yes. Somebody told me na, plinano mo talaga maging nanay. Yes. Talaga? <laughs> Oo. Pangarap ko yun. Ewan ko ba, nung lagi ko niloloko yung nanay ko nun dati, naglalagay ako ng balloon sa loob. Na. Sabi ko, Mao, oh, buntis ako, gaganan ako. <laughs> <laughs> no, kasi parang I think po, ah, parang kahit nung bata ako, ang sarap-sarap sa mata, makita na mayroong dalawang taong nag-aalaga, nagmamahala, na at saka alam ko na balang araw meron at meron akong makakasama sa buhay. Mm. Pangarap mo talaga maging nanay, pa, pangarap mo maging isang asawa, may bahay. Okay? But you know, I'll go straight again to another, another sensitive question. Kasi may mga spec speculations na naghiwalay kayo or naghiwalay na kayo ng ama ng iyong anak na si Uno. Is it a yes? Is it, is it a no? What is the story? Yes, Tito Boy, um, naghiwalay na po kami uh, nung tatay ni Uno. Um, we really tried, you know, our best, um, just like everybody else. Mm -mm. But it didn't work out. Pero ang maganda dyan, Tito Boy, kasi we're good friends, eh. Very, very good. And um, we're doing our very best, you know, to co-parent Uno. And I'm actually proud of ourselves, kami dalawa, kasi hanggat maaga, inaayos na namin siya. Para hanggat pag lumaki na si Uno, alam mo po yun, peaceful po kami. And we can still be a family mm. na wala na pong mga issue-issue sa both sides. Maraming salamat for trusting us and for trusting the show. Kasi wala nang manghuhula, di ba? Yes. Isang araw when Rita falls in love again, <laughs> di ba? Hindi ah, yes! <laughs> <laughs> you have that sense na I am, I am okay, I, I, I am ready to fall in love again. Definitely yes. It's mm. of course it's still one of my dreams to be, you know, um, na maglakad 
na may wedding gown. So of course, part pa rin yun ang aking pangarap. But now, not yet. Not yet because right now, I'm, my, my focus is to be a better person and to be the best mom to Uno. Sino ang una mong sinabihan na naghiwalay kayo ng uh, partner mo? My sister. Mm, okay. My sister, yes. Um, oh, iyak mm. din. Hindi tayo iyak, no? <laughs> Lalaki lang yarn. <laughs> okay, go back to that conversation. How did you say it? Um, ako ang sinabi ko noon, uh, ate, I think, mula na kami, ganun lang. Casual. Um, at saka, sigurado na kami. Kasi alam naman ng family ko na tinatry namin many times eh. Um, matagal din kami together. Like, almost four years together. We really tried our best. Um, but now, yun nga, again, I'm, I'm happy kasi klaro naman yun sa amin dalawa na ito yung papel namin sa buhay ni Uno. But of course, yes, definitely, mas, ma, mas sakit yung painful yun, Tito Boy, sa akin yung That experience. Yun. One day, Uno is going to watch this. Yes. This interview, this conversation. Uh, wala na ngayong nawawala. He's going to listen to whatever you're gonna say. Kung meron kang mensahe para sa yung anak, that he will hear, he will watch 10, 15 years from now? Yes. Ano ang nais mong sabihin sa iyong anak? First of all, thank you so much for giving me this opportunity because not every mom can have this opportunity, you know? So, uno, nanay will always love and support you no hmm. matter what. I love you for who you are. Keep being you and I'm very proud of you. Always remember, anak, that you are kind, you are important, you are loved, you are blessed, and that Jesus loves you and He is always with you. And I promise to sing for you always and forever. So, anak, ano ba tayo? Red wine or white wine? <laughs> <laughs> Sinabi ni Uno Helmbao sa iyo, Mom, what happened to dad? How will you explain that to him? Ang sasabihin ko, um, anak, si nanay at tatay, nagmahalan ng sobra. Kaya, dumating ka. Nagkataon lang talaga, anak, na may mga bagay sa buhay na hindi para sa isa't isa. At isa kami doon ng tatay. That's mo. what happened. And that's what happened. Sabi ni Uno, Sino si Tito Ken? <laughs> eto na nga, Tito Boy, kinakabahan na ako dyan. Ganto-ganto <laughs> sasabi ko, eto na nga anak, makinig ka. <laughs> si Tito Ken. Hindi, <laughs> best friend siya ni nanay. Okay. At isa ako dun sa nakulog sa best friend. Okay. Sana anak, kung isang araw mangyari sa'yo, nandun si nanay para suportahan ka. Pero okay kayo ni Tito Ken, ha? Ni Tito Ken? Yes, you're okay. Yes, we're very open. That's good. Maraming maraming salamat. Maraming salamat. And salamat. I, I'm sure it's going to happen. Diba? Everything is on the net now. And, you know, when he's 18, 16, he's going to eavesdrop on this conversation. You made uh, famous a character of Aubrey. Hindi ko malilimutan yun. Salamat. Po. Dalhin mo nga ngayon yung character na yun. Ay? At halimbawa lang nag uh, prepresenta ka mag-guest. Dito sa Fast Talk with okay Boy po. Abunda. Okay po. Uh, how would you do it? 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, action! Uy! Grabe yung ganda naman dito. La! Para ka mo ako yun! Ay! Wala tito boy! Uy tito boy! <laughs> Grabe naman talaga. Kayo pa rin mo ng jowa mo. Oo no, naman. Talaga? <laughs> Ingat ka. Ay! Kaya ako! Eto na nga! Tito boy, di ba ito yung mga sinasabi mo? Kung ikaw yung haharap sa salamin, anong sasabihin sa sarili mo? Proud of you. Ingat ka. <laughs> Sa nalinga, boy! Yes! Nasa ka na ba't magsili na dala mo ako dito? Hindi ko naman alam yung ginagawa ko dito eh. Kinakabahan na ako eh. Hello po, tito boy. Ay, hi, hello po. Maka nakikita na ba ako sa TV? Sige, nakita lang po lang kulat. <laughs> I enjoyed it. Maraming, maraming salamat. All the best. All the best. Thank you. Continue to sing, continue to act, continue to do whatever you do. Host. I you know, will. just fly. I will. Just fly. Oh, nandito kami.
Salamat. Maraming maraming salamat. Thank Night you. Night ay kapuso. Maraming salamat po sa inyong pagpapatuloy sa amin, sa inyong mga tahanan at sa inyong mga puso. Suportahan po natin si Rita. Really, you love have you. our love, respect and support. Love and panoorin niyo po Sundays, uh, 11.30 in the evening, Kaitan in Action with Boy Abunda and of course, Boys of La Carmela at the Barakay. Maraming maraming salamat. Let's talk again tomorrow. Goodbye for now and God bless. Woo!